everybody, I am Easy Badfish, and welcome back to Groovealicious. This is episode number 8, and today we've got a little bit of a special idea in mind. Uh, I did do some work around the house, and we can talk about that, but that's really for another episode. Today I've got something else in plan. But, I wanted to show you guys real quick that I think the animals have been spawning around the base since I've been hanging out here. There's only two llamas to start with. I've been breeding them up. And now, they're all over the place. They're pretty awesome. So, what are we doing today, you might be asking. Well, you may recall that a certain old person on the server and his uh, companion were out here being very nice and helpful and left me a bunch of beds. You may remember that. In fact, it's nighttime. So I can show you something else that's cool on the server that we have now. Check this out. We now have one player sleeping. I am not the only person on the server right now. Soul Kitten's own. Lost Soul Kitten. <laughs> I think Faith Kitten is one, and Lost Soul is another. So, my bad about that. Well, that person is online, and I was able to sleep. So that is done. So, what are we doing? Well, we're going to head over and... Uh, Help out you fog a little bit, you know. He's got, uh, he's been doing a lot of work on his base, and I just want to help him out, you know. Be a nice guy. I'm new to the server. I want to repay the favor. So we're going to run down here, and we're going to grab some materials. And, uh, one of the things I do need to do is buy a couple of name tags off of him. Because we're going to be doing that later this afternoon. Oh, and the other thing. Yeah. Alright, I know he's been working on the nether. I don't know how much... I don't actually think he's shown any of it on his YouTube videos yet, but he has shown it on stream. So I'm assuming it's okay to run you guys through the nether. Because I kind of want to show you uh, what what he's been working on. It's really... Well, him and him and Looney, man, they are... They are really going nuts, I tell you. They are... Uh, <laughs> House is looking good. So, it's a little bit safer here. And as you can see, it's been dug out quite a bit. Oh, man, they are working on some stuff. Uh, I haven't even seen that yet. I'm going to just kind of keep my head down. I know... See, that's the spawn portal. Yep, that's the zinger's portal. Yeah, they got beacons all over the place. I'm really curious to see what that glass thing was. But uh, I'll come back and look at that later. You guys aren't allowed to see it. I kind of figured this big, long strip of slabs is okay to see. There's not a whole lot going on here. Uh, so yeah, in fact, there's so little going on. I'm going to cut here, and I'm going to come back once I'm at UFOG's base. Alright guys, I am back, and uh, we are at UFOG's base now. Uh, if, you ha if you're not watching his streams, you really should be, because he's shown off a lot of this stuff on his streams already. I think it's the one with the... yeah... You should definitely also check out his channel. Um, him and Looney have really been working hard out here. I will obviously put links to all that in the description. We are looking for his storage room, which I am pretty sure is down this way somewhere. If I remember correctly. It's here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, I was back here a few days ago, shortly after the official 1.11 release, and man, this place is amazing. Um, and there, there was creepers in here. This place is so dark. Now, it does look like he's put a few torches in here, but I'm pretty sure there's still some dark spots in here. So what we want to do, is I really just want to make, I really just want to come in here and help him out and make sure that there are no spawnable spots in here because the last thing you want is a creeper coming in here in your storage room, right? I mean, there's chests full of stuff in here, right? I mean, you got trap doors, all kinds of stuff. <laughs> Seriously. The, yeah, it was it was kind of funny. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my crafting bench here and we are going to craft up us some slabs. That's right. And uh, I should point out that I happen to know that this is like their favorite block. So I'm sure they're going to absolutely love this. 
Oh, another thing. If my voice is sounding a little weird, it's because it's really early in the morning, and uh, it's one of the only times I know for sure that I'll have at least an hour <laughs> without without you, Fog and Looney, online. Sorry about that. Alarm went off. I was just saying that uh, this is it's pretty early, so it's one of the only times that I know for a fact that uh, you, Fog and Looney, are not going to be here. So I should have plenty of time to uh, yeah to do this without them showing up, and I'm going to lose my. That stinks. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put it right here in these trapdoors. Because I don't like wasting anything. And I'll pick that up in a little bit. Alright. Um yeah, there's a lot of space back here. A lot of space. I don't know if I have enough. It's gonna suck if I don't. Yeah, look at this. You see what I'm talking about? Do you see what I'm talking about? Clearly. Clearly they just want mobs spawning back here. But that's okay. I'm going to help them out. I don't want them to lose any of their stuff. <laughs> oh, I am... I thought 12 stacks was going to be enough, but I don't think it is now. Alright, so I'm going to lay some slabbage down, and I will catch you guys in a bit. Hey guys, quick little update. I have severely underestimated this project once again. <laughs> I brought 12, I brought enough stacks to break, to have 12 stacks of bricks, brick slabs, and uh, it's not enough. It's not enough, I'm almost out already, and I'm not even done with the first room. Oy, oy, oy. I'm going to end up having to go get more, I think, I'm going to have to think of a way, of a place to do that, because I'd spent about an hour last night tearing all of the clay out of the river near my house. Um, I think there's another section of river, but I I don't know how much clay is going to be in there. So hopefully, hopefully I can get enough. I'm not even able to do all the things. There's a whole other side to this that I'm gonna, I wanted to do, but I'm not going to do that. We'll just say, that, I mean, this is all his overflow storage. We'll just say that we're protecting his overflow storage <laughs> instead of his whole storage system as was originally planned. Because, yeah, I I don't know why on earth I thought the 12 stacks would be enough but yeah it is definitely not um, I'm not even able to get in in here I'm just kinda getting in the back walkways so yeah I'm gonna keep doing this and hopefully I got enough stuff I'll see you guys in a bit hey guys I'm back and I'm in a bit of trouble <laughs> I wanted to show you I, I couldn't hit the record button quick enough so I had to run out of the room I don't have a shield I do have a shield alright all right, <laughs> messing up everything. Oh, that's not right. Okay. See what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying, you fog? You see what I'm saying? I'm in here trying to help you out, and you got guys spawning in here trying to kill me. It just ain't cool, man. It just ain't cool. Oh crap! Oh god! Oh god! No! <laughs> Hey. That's cool, you fog. That guy even spawned up there. He started up there. How did he even get up there, man? Look at me. Look at me. I'm now I'm in here lighting up his base for him. What is wrong with me? You fog. <laughs> All right. See you guys in a second guys apparently I didn't hit stop record at some point so I'm not sure if my clips are gonna work out hopefully everything's okay but anyway I am out of slabs I've got to race back to my base now and find some more um, I do have a few more clay balls I don't think I have enough to I definitely don't have enough there's no way I'm gonna have enough to do both sides of this I'd really really like to be able to get in here and up along top of the well Maybe not along the top of these. That might be a little much, just because he's going to have to use a pick to break these. I mean, if he breaks one block of the floor, that's not that big a deal. But breaking this stuff up here could be super annoying, so I'm not going to do that to him. Uh, but I do definitely need to go find some more, uh, some more bricks right away. So I'm going to cut, and I'm going to run back to my base. Oh, I hope I have time. I'd have no idea what time he is going to wake up and be back online, so hopefully 
Hopefully he doesn't do that while we're working. All right, see you guys when I get back. <laughs> I got a little bit more clay. All right, guys, I am back, and I have got a few more slabs here. I went and took out a whole nother inventory full worth of clay, and uh, I guess we're going to get back to it. We don't. We're getting close here, especially if we're just going to do this one side. Um, yeah. So I'm going to get back to laying these down, and uh, I will see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, I am back, and I am pretty much calling this done. I have uh, put slabs throughout the whole area, the brick slabs, pretty much everywhere. You can still get down and into everything, which is why I wanted to make sure. And this is just the overflow side. I, I'm not able to get to the other side. I just don't have enough slabs, and I don't have enough time. I am already basically out of time for this. I, am, I really should be getting to work now. <laughs> so I'm going to find a place to leave a sign. I think I know where I'm going to do it uh, out front. Oh, yeah. And I wanted to make sure you guys knew that I, I really am trying to be careful. I don't want anything bad to happen to his base. So, you know, I've been putting torches down, making sure that stuff is lit up where it needs to be. And uh, I actually think this area is safer now than it was when I got here. So there you go. <laughs> so I'm going to leave. Do I even have a sign? I don't even have a freaking sign. All right, that's fine. I got stuff to make one. I'm going to end up having like a million signs by the end of this season just because I keep forgetting to bring them with me. And then, you know, you can't just make one. You make three. So I'll use one. And then I'll have two left over. Put them in a chest back in my base and forget about them until the next time I need a sign. And then it's like, oh, well, let me make three more. <laughs> uh... Let's see, what should it say? Um, helped spawn proof. Let's get rid of this. I helped spawn proof the overflow. You're welcome. Easy. <laughs> All right. Well, that's good. So now what I've got to do is I've got to find where his fish farm is. I actually don't know where that is. So uh, I am going to look around for a bit because he said I, I mentioned in Discord the other night that I really needed uh, I really needed some what you call it name tags, and uh, he said he had some, and that I, you know I was more than welcome to him, but I. Uh, he didn't actually leave them for me anywhere, so I don't know where they are. I gotta find his fish arm. I will be back when I find it. Seriously, man. Seriously. Light up your base, dude. <laughs> Come on. Hey, everybody. I'm back. And, uh, man, I have been looking around his base for quite a while. And I never did find the fish farm, but I think I found... Well, I mean, I, I don't think I found... I did find the stash of fish farm stuff. Like, uh... Yeah, I was first tipped off by all of this fish. Um, uh, yeah, where is it? Here we go. So I need a couple name tags. He said I could have some. Um, I'm going to leave him two diamonds. Actually, should I make another chest? I think I should make another chest. I'm going to take uh, for two diamonds, or I think five five name uh, name tag well I mean it's a fish farm so they're pretty easy to get I think five name tags per diamond is fair yeah does that sound fair I mean look how many they have <laughs> I uh yeah I'm gonna leave him a, I'm gonna leave him a chest he doesn't he doesn't need another chest I will leave I will leave a sign on this chest Took ten tags. I always do that. I always spell tags with an E like that for some reason. I don't know why. Took ten tags, left two diamonds. Why can I space but I can't add another letter? What the? 
Oh, is because E is too long? Oh, Java stuff. Jeez. If that's not, if that's no good. Okay. Oh, we got our name tags. That's what we actually came here for. <laughs> I mean, that's that's the reason we decided to do this today because I need the name tag. All right. So we we have left a little bit of a prank for you, Fog. Nothing big. I know it's not the best ever, but honestly. I am I am short on resources, I am short on time, um, so that's basically the best I could do with, with what I have right now. So I'm going to head back to my base. Hey everybody, I am back, and as you can see, I took a little bit of a detour and found another fortress. <laughs> Actually, Ufog showed me where this is, and I've been up here for a little while, kind of extending and widening out these platforms where there's a crossroads, trying to increase my uh, wither skeleton. Um, spawning, so I, I'm, I'm trying to trying to get some skulls. I'm really hoping to get a beacon, but I don't think I'm going to be able to today. I'm going to hang out for just a little bit longer to see if I can get another skull, but uh, here in a second we're going to head back to base because we're getting close on this episode, and I still got to make a banner. Alright, see you guys in a second. Hey everybody, I am back, and man, what a freaking adventure this has been. I have been gone away from you guys for so long. It's been almost two full days since I recorded that, that prank on Ufog. His video's already out and everything. So I'll put a link to that in the description, obviously. Um, so, I am back at the house, and I have been fighting Wither Skulls skeletons all day, trying to get their skulls. I have killed well over a hundred to get the four skulls that I needed. Um, 103. I did not get killed, though, by a wither skeleton. I didn't get killed at all. You see, I still only have four deaths. Uh, so that has been great. And you may be asking, well, why do you need a beacon, or, uh, four skulls if you already have a beacon? Well, I needed one for my banner. And I gotta say, I recorded this earlier, and I realized that I had not recorded my audio. So I had to re-record, and unfortunately I just don't have enough dyes to redo the banner section so we'll just have to go from here I did name the white llama Devi you guys missed that too I'm sorry about that it is named after my friend Dre Devero or Devero I'm sorry I'm not really sure how to say it he won't tell me so uh, he also has a new friend this guy wandered up from the bottom where I was breeding up the rest of them so yeah that's fun we're gonna go put the beacon in I wanna show you guys the last step of the banner at least um, so in order to get it so far it started off with a black banner I put a cyan stripe on the left a lime stripe on the right a purple purple wither skeleton in the middle and then we're gonna surround it with purple again to give me the border so uh, man I, I feel really silly about not recording my audio but that is what my banner looks like so I've now got my original it's now here I can make copies of this once I get some more black wool I do have a black sheep he's just I've just uh, I gotta shear him some more, but, uh, you know. That is what it is. How do I... Come on, now. Alright. That was... That was being weird. Okay. So, I'm gonna run down. We're gonna put our beacon in. And, uh, I, before we do that, I kinda wanna show you guys. I put in this pillar and the balcony up here. I've gone ahead and put in some stairs along everywhere, just to kinda make it easier to run up and down. This is I'm uh, this is probably not permanent. Almost 100% sure that I am going to be changing these stairs out, especially these down here. But I just I really get tired of this jump, jump, jump. But yeah, so I've got the pillars here, real basic starting the structure here of the support here, and I'm going to be adding more to this. Obviously, this is just so you guys can get an idea of what I'm doing. We're going to run down here to where the beacon is going to go. I've already got it set up. I uh, did not have enough of any one type of block. I am basically out of iron now. So I am going to have to go and do some mining, it looks like. We'll get this beacon set up here. I will add our ingot. And we want... What do we want? What do I want? Uh, let's do resistance and regen. 
because this is just going to be out for around the area and uh, not having regen this is going to help out a little bit I have been breeding up the llamas as I said so there's quite a few more now uh, they are well and good spread out here um, I don't know why <laughs> but they are they're all over the place um, so yeah that's what I've got going on for now I think I'm gonna have to call that an episode because we are closing in on 20 minutes we might even have gone over at this point so uh, thanks for watching if you liked the video leave a like maybe leave me a comment especially uh, let me know what I should name that other llama or if you got any ideas for the area as always but uh, yeah thanks a lot guys and I'll see you guys next time bye